All right, Pet Man Matt Marr, Charlotte Football Insiders. Um, we're talking to a very talented running back out of South Point High School in Belmont, the Red Raiders. And you see him right there busting the big one, uh, which he's done a lot this season because he's got a ton of rushing yards and a lot of touchdowns. His name is Tyson Riley. Uh, Tyson, how you doing, man? I'm doing great, sir. How about yourself? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Um, you know, I was just talking to you before this and, you know, telling you, you're very impressive, man. The, the thing that really impresses me the most about you is the way you run so hard, you know, in that South Point offense. And I, and I got to ask you, um, where do you get that from? I get it from my dad. My dad was a tough runner, and uh, he went to the University of Arkansas and later played at Murray State. And, you know, we've always trained, and, you know, I've always been in the gym, and so we've always worked on being able to be elusive, fast, knowing down the distance, and where we want to go and where we got to get. So, yeah, it, it's it's one of the um, the strong suits I think you have at the running back position. Um, you know, while we're on that, in your opinion, what is the best things uh, you do on the football field at you know the running back spot? I feel like my best ability on the football field is being able to break tackles and explode and score touchdowns and uh, also encouraging my teammates when we're down and we got to make a big play. And um, we haven't been down recently too much this season, but, you know, still we got to we have to make big plays. And when the game is not going nowhere, somebody's got to make a play and we got to keep on moving that rock. Amen. Well said. Well said, man. And, you know, I agree with what you said about, you know, your skill on the field. And the thing that impresses me the most is you're gaining all these yards from that up back position where – you know, primarily you're going right up the middle. And um, that's where all the people are at. <laughs> yeah. So. Um, second yeah. game of the season, we had 10 people in the box. And I had rushed for uh, I rushed for 166 yards. And Coach took me out of the game at third quarter. I had four touchdowns that game. <laughs> Good gracious, man. That, that – that is impressive stuff, man. So, see, you got, I'm sure you got excited on this one because you actually got to get outside the box a little bit on the little option. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> but it still shows your ability and space to be explosive and, you know, run away from people, which, you know, is a great, you know, running back um, trait to have uh, for sure. Uh, well, let's step back a little bit, Tyson. Um, go back to when you were younger. Uh, what made you want to play football in the first place? What made me want to play football in the first place was, you know, the aggressiveness. I've always been aggressive. Uh, my first sport, first couple sports I played was soccer, football, and wrestling. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I've always had to be able to have endurance and also have to be able to, you know, battle through tough times and, you know, battle through the blood, battle through the weakness. So I've always had to move and push harder. Wow, that's impressive, man. So playing soccer and uh, wrestling um, – is football your favorite sport? Yes, sir, it is. Good stuff, man. But I, I think you're a pretty good wrestler. Did I read that somewhere? Yes, sir. I took second in the state this past year. Oh, man, that, that's more than pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> that's and, awesome. In the 152-pound weight class, sir. Awesome. Congratulations, man. That's awesome. Really, really, really impressive. Thank you, sir. Um, What's your best memory playing high school football so far in your career? My best memory of playing high school football is when we beat the Shelby Golden Lions. Um, in South in South Point history, they have a big, huge rival with Shelby. Mm -hmm. And um, going into the game, I was really nervous. You know, everybody's telling me that they're this really big team, that they're this really great team. And, um, you know, and then the love that the team gave me, like, it was a really, really big win. Like, everybody in Belmont knew that how big that game was and they even have a song <laughs> about beating it when we beat shelby <laughs> oh really <laughs> yes sir i don't know the exact lyrics uh. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah man, if somebody's watching this y'all send me that song i'll i'll play it on on, <laughs> on our live show man I'd, I'd love to hear that <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> that's, that's great that was this past spring right yes sir it was yeah good stuff man that's great um, what do you like most about the experience of playing at South Point? Um, they took me in really well, and uh, it took me a couple games to learn the system. Mm -hmm. And um, the community is really welcoming. 
they're very very welcoming because I um, I transferred here my junior year from Florida. Okay. okay. And I was uh, playing at the Bowl School, and oh. um, they're a top ten contender for the state championship every year in 4A in Florida. And um, it really it really I really saw that because I'm also a military kid, and I've also had there was times where I was struggling to move in, mm-hmm. and um, and that it really didn't take no time for me to move in here and make friends and be able to adjust and play here. So I found that that very it was very welcoming for me. That's good to hear, man. That's really good to hear. It's impressive. And I've heard of bowls. They're they're a annual contender, you know, down yeah. there in Florida. So they're good, good stuff, man. Really good stuff. Um what NFL player would you compare your game to at the running back position? Oh uh, well this past Friday I, I got compared to Maurice Jones Drew, so Hmm. I mean, so I guess I play like Marsha Jones. <laughs> <laughs> I could see that because you know he was a shorter running back, and mm-hmm. you know he was he was tough. He really got tough yards on the inside, just like mm-hmm. you. Yeah, I could see that. That's a good comparison. There, yeah. good stuff. Um, do you listen to music before the game? If so, uh, what's the uh, kind of music or the favorite song that kind of gets you in the right mindset? Uh, yeah, I listen to music before the game. I listen to a little baby, uh, something to prove, you know, because I've always been the smallest guy on the field. People, when they see me, they don't think I can do much when I get out there. But when they see me and I'm actually out there on that field and I'm actually doing my thing or I'm on the wrestling mat doing my thing, they they are shocked. And so I've always got something to prove. <laughs> I love that, man. Hey, and you tell them people to watch the game tape. <laughs> <laughs> If the defense don't know who you are, they ain't doing it their, their work. That's for yeah. sure. <laughs> um, what's the one thing you like most about your teammates uh, at South Point? Um, we persevere, and uh, when the when we got one person down, the next man is up, and they do that to the best of their ability. And um, the coaches and we push everybody pushes each other to the next level, mm-hmm. and that's why we perform so well on Fridays. And we're always in tough games, and uh, everybody says that they really got to prepare for us because if not, it's going to be a tough game for them. And so Absolutely. we always, you know, are pushing ourselves. In the weight room, outside of the weight room, we're always getting extra work on weekends, and we're always pushing ourselves, watching film, and we correct those uh, mistakes in film. And we make sure, like, if they got a key player that they have, and we're watching that person – and we're we're making sure that person is getting blocked. We're making sure that person is having a tough night. Mm, well said, well said, man. Excellent. All right, my last question for you, Tyson. Uh, who do you want to thank? You know, for the football success you've experienced in your career so far. I want to thank God, and uh, He's been very He's really blessed me this past co- couple years, and uh, especially putting me in Belmont because. Uh, this past, in the past, I wasn't really playing as much. They had me playing out, out of position at the bowl school. Mm. They had me playing safety. And um, it really wasn't it really wasn't for me. And they, like, I, there was times where I would play and I just didn't feel like, feel like playing. And it was, like, really hurt because I've, I've always played running back. I've always been a running back. And I knew that I had the chance to, and they just didn't want to give me that chance out there to prove them that I could play that. Mm-hmm. And South Point, you know, welcomed me and they gave me that chance. And I also want to thank my parents, you know, for allowing me to allow me to come there and be able to perform there. And um, my coaches, they've also they've taught me a lot. And um, my my granddad, the people at the church, and uh, they've really helped me, blessed me a lot these past couple of years. Man, that's awesome. That's awesome. I love to see, you know, a young man such as yourself, you know, excelling in the classroom, also a 3.5 GPA. Um, you know, that, that the, these, these, this is the reason why we do this stuff, because, you know, you deserve to be highlighted and celebrated for everything that you've overcome and everything that you're doing. So college coaches watching this, you know, you need to reach out to this young man, give him a shot. You know, he can help a program on the next level. No doubt about it, man. Uh, Tyson, I appreciate the time, man. And, um, you know, hopefully I'll see you again and I can meet you in person and we can, um, 
you know, talk a little bit then too, man. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, thank you, man. Appreciate it.